third generation farmer down here in Bonzo, California. We've got 325 acres planted in the ground. Uh, we've been in business now for 20 years and uh, my grandfather and my uncle love the farms. They come out all the time and love touching the soil. He was a big component of the farmer's footsteps or the best fertilizer. I've been fortunate enough to be able to come here and continue the legacy on. We grow citrus and avocados, a lot of varieties, lemons, blood oranges. We're constantly looking at how we can improve our operation. One of our biggest problems in the area is, is the high salts in our well waters and our district water. The chlorides and the salts have been terrible. With the drought, it gets worse every year. So what we've done through the guidance of our PCA and local fertilizer reps is we've started to begin a salt remediation program. Uh, one thing that we really love is our CATS program. It's calcium thiosulfate and what it does is it actually opens up the soil and just allows us to actually effectively drive sodium particles through the soil. I've you know tested it and our levels have gone down significantly in our plant tissue and our soil analysis. So it's working and we're going to continue to do it and, it, and it's certainly showing up in the health of the trees and, you know, in our avocados. They just tell you the story, you know. They're very highly sensitive to the, the salts and at the end of the year, in about November, they just brown out, tip burn. The worse the salt buildup is, the worse the tip burn is. Uh, where we put the cats out, it's really reduced it significantly. So we've always been a big proponent of having healthy soils and by by opening up our soils, our roots have more air and water and the microbial activity is stronger and allows the roots to be healthier and fight off some of the different funguses that we have in our soils here. After making my CATS application, I can see the effects within a few days, if not a few weeks, rather than when I was doing my gypsum applications, it was, you know, I don't really ever know when I saw those. The highly sensitive nature of citrus and avocados, salts are the most limiting factor. So by driving those salts down and keeping them out of the root zone, not only keep production where it was, but we've increased production and it has definitely given us a great return on investment. The idea of wasting water in order to leach salts it doesn't make any sense to me at all. So I could spend $1,500 extra in water to leach the salts or I could spend $100 on cats and get a better effect actually with a healthier root system and healthier structure and soil. In a general rule of thumb, we put it out four times a year, but you know, it may be five or six. I mean, if we don't get any rains, we're gonna have to put it out again. You know, I have neighbors all the time ask me what they can do to improve their operation. Most of the time, they have no salt remediation program, and I always recommend CATS because for, you know, it doesn't cost that much more to the overall budget, and for the results that you get, it's probably the biggest bang for your buck. I've been fortunate enough to be able to come here and continue the legacy on, and, and hopefully my children, can, the next generation, can continue to run these farms. But we're only going to be able to do it through increasing our efficiency and our productivity and just being good stewards of the soil. Yeah.